Right guys, I'm hoping you can see this and I'm hoping you can hear me okay. This is the pouch, as I said. This is my friend's pouch. This is the one she's basically starting to, going to be starting to use soon. We have added my gear into this because at the end of the day, she said there's no point going home, grabbing all of our gear to do this video. So we decided that we're going to use my stuff. At the end of the day, we have done a two, two small modifications to this pouch already. And that's only because something didn't, the two things, they didn't fit. So, yeah. I cannot tell you the size of this because I don't honestly truthfully know. As you can see, that's how wide. It's not very, it's not big at all. Yeah, but it's quite useful. And if you didn't own already, she's turned this into a fire kit. And I think it is a very smart idea. Right, I'm going to turn the table. I'm hoping so it can fit everything in. No, it don't. Right, I'll turn it back. I'll just have to move the table. I can't move the camera because if I move the camera, then I'm just going to get lost again. Right, it's not to do with the contents, guys. It's just mainly to do with the pouch, but I will go for the contents as well with you guys. But as you can see, there's a massive, there's a big zip here. And this zip here, hard to believe, does the whole length of this pouch in underneath every single thing. Yeah, as you can see, there's four um, elastic strappings here. Yeah, as you can see, I've got, we put a pocket pedals, we put a, a square, ferrocene rod in, the easy sharpener, as well as the Opinel number eight, I think it is. Yep, Opinel number eight. Fits quite comfortably in there quite well. And that's one thing I think was quite smart when it came to this pouch. As I said, it's not my pouch, but it's smart. You just... You can open it up and straight away, right in front of you, you got your pocket pedals, you got your ferro rod, you got your easy striker or easy sharpener, but you can use it as a striker, and you've got an opener number eight. You can add an opener, a larger opener as you needed to. But yeah, I thought that was quite smart. And as well as you've got this large pouch here, and I mean it's large, as you can see, there's stuff in it. As well, see here, guys, there's another little pouch. I don't understand that, but you can lift it up and down. But this, even this, is quite big. This has just got the my char cloth tin in it, my stormproof matches, my big lighter with the Echo Tech or Echo, whatever you want to call it, Echo Tech Tack lighter sleeve, um, magnifying mag 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 glass. As well as one of these Ecotech nano sparks. And it all fits in there. Comfortable. With still lots of room. To move things around. You can... Everything. It's mountains of room in here. Right. We'll move to this. Um, I'm just moving the pouch along because it's easier than moving the table. Here. They had four slots. She turned them into two because she wanted them into two. Because what? She has exactly the same thing as I've done here, guys. We've done exactly the same thing with her fat wood and her cotton balls. Yes, you could not you didn't have to do it this way, you could add something else into these, but we found with that ferro rod, it fits, but it goes all the way down to the bottom. And it's all good to get out. That fits, but it don't you can't get it out. These two fit. Nope, that one there didn't fit, that one there fit, but you can't get it out easy. And we found just and we were working out if you put everything in there, it's just gonna be awkward. The same again, you're just gonna be digging around with everything all the time. So we, so we, she's decided to do this and as you can see if it's two cotton balls what we've done and three pieces of fatwood quite nicely but yeah we will i will leave links to this in the description in the description box guys it's only a quick one but it is a nice little thing i think it was meant to be a tool pouch thing and she's turned it in she's going to turn it into a fire kit i'm thinking about getting one of these for myself i'm no, I've got quite a few pouches now when it comes to fire stuff, but I actually do like this a lot. I think it's smart. I think it's a good idea. Right. Um, thank you very much for watching, and we'll see you soon. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel, because we will be adding a lot more content about gear ideas like this one. Thank you. Bye-bye.